So I came out here today, I thought I'd shoot a little video. It's just me today, because my filmographer is making banana bread. My shooting partner's playing Legos, and my attack dog is taking a nap. Anyway, I bought my, brought my Springfield Saint pistol. You know, I saw somebody did a video on it that was talking one of these short-barreled pistols, and uh, they were sitting on a pack, and they couldn't hit something at 100 yards. They were saying the guns weren't any good, so... You know, I haven't had any issues with this. I actually really dig it. I don't have a short-barreled rifle. So having this pistol that's kind of like a short-barreled rifle, it's about my favorite thing to carry now. You know, really small and lightweight. Like I said, it's got a seven and a half inch barrel. I'm shooting 55 grain hollow points out of there, federal hollow points. Just gonna use the EOTech and let's see what I can do. I got some steel set up out here. I don't know if you can see them all. There's there's a 25, a 50, and then a 100. It's kind of tucked away up there in the pine trees. But let's see if I can hit everything freehand in it. Okay, 25, it's dead on. Okay, it looks about the center of the chest at the 50. And that hit the silhouette at 100. So anybody who's got one of these short barreled pistols that can't hit anything at 100 yards sitting on a pack, I don't know, maybe you need some shooting lessons or something. But these are really groovy. If you thought about getting one, I dig everything about it. You know, I'm used to a Picatinny rail all the way up front. I like to keep my EOTex way up at the end of the barrel. I know people think that's kind of weird, but I kind of dig it. You know, my idea behind it is it's easy to adjust it up and down with having to take my hand off the gun. If my EOTex way in the back of the gun, then I got to take my hand off the forearm to adjust it. So I can adjust it when it's up here closer. Puts a little extra weight to fight muzzle rise and Actually, you can get on the red sight quicker, the, the further forward it is, you can get on the red dot quicker without having to get your face way down low onto the stock. So I like that for quick action stuff. So, I'm going to shoot a little bit of stuff. And uh, the same pistol, I'm digging it. Twenty-five, fifty, and hundred. This is some groovy stuff, right? Plus that little short stuff. What are you getting your gun for if it's for defense? Little tiny package like this that can rip right out to hundred yards accurately. This is some cool stuff, man. Talk to you guys soon. Keep safe. So I had to add this at the end of the video. So I walked out to the hundred. Look at those two strikes at hundred yards with this seven and a half inch barreled gun. That's some awesome stuff, right? About the jawline, damn, forgive me, I'm getting old. Breathing like a damn old man walking out here. Good stuff, St. A.R. Pistol, Springfield Armory. Pretty groovy, keep safe.